Okay, next up in our video series, we're going to be doing our, I think this is the 2.5 inch, pretty sure. This is the 2.5 inch round indent mold that you can put your bubble frosting on the top and stick a toy on the top. So it consists of your two cups and your outside shell. And your top cup has that indent in it, and this is the smooth edge. This is not the sharp edge, this is the flat, smooth edge, which is my preference because it comes out cleaner. Okay, so what we wanna do is we wanna go ahead and put that on the bottom, take our outside shell, stick it on the top. Start lightly filling. If you want to go ahead and give some pushes just to ensure you get that nice ring around there, you can. Take our top cup, turn it over, stick it on the top, and we're going to give some pushes. Take your uh, fingers on the bottom of your outside shell and just move your shell up and down until you can easily take it completely off of those two cups. If you like the Saturn ring, leave it alone. If you don't, give it another push. All right, now I'm gonna turn it over because this is the top that has the indent. So we're gonna start giving some taps. Turn it over and tap the bottom. Now that's the part that you wanna unmold first and I'll show you how I dry them. So up and off with that bottom cup. And then I take these small little clear cups that I get from the Dollar Tree. You can get a four pack for $1. It fits perfectly on the bottom of your two and a half. It even fits the 2.75 round sphere molds. But that's how I do it. Turn it over and then straight up and off. Now go slow with this so you don't um, mess up the top indent part. Just go straight up and off. And there you got a beautiful indented round sphere bath bomb mold with the flat smooth edge. Fill that with your bubble frosting, stick a toy on the top. Cute as hell, I sell a lot of these. All right, you guys, so if you wanna purchase that or any of our other molds that we have for sale, you can find it on soap-chef.com. I will leave the link down below.